Hi everyone and welcome to my video series where I'll be showing you how to create a complete landing page using the WP Astra theme and the Spectra page builder later on. This series is designed especially for beginners and I've structured each part to be easy to follow even if you are new to WordPress. In this video we are going to take a closer look at the WP Astra theme the Astra theme is a popular and very user-friendly WordPress theme that is available for free. But it also has a pro version that unlocks some additional and powerful features. The free version alone provides great functionalities, but if you need more advanced features, the pro version adds even more options to customize and enhance your website. I think one of the biggest advantages of the Astra theme is that the developers focus heavily on speed and efficiency. It's important to mention that Astra doesn't use jQuery. Instead, it relies entirely on vanilla JavaScript, which means less code needs to be loaded, improving speed and performance. If you don't know about jQuery, it's a popular JavaScript library, but using it can sometimes slow down a website as it requires extra code to be loaded. The Astra developers chose to stick with vanilla JavaScript, which is a faster and a more modern solution as it doesn't require loading external libraries. Vanilla JavaScript can be handled by any web browser by default. The Astra theme's focus on efficiency can also be seen in other aspects of the theme. They only use native WordPress functionalities, meaning that the theme fully leverages the capabilities of WordPress without the need for unnecessary plugins or extra code. This is especially important when you want your site to load quickly, as faster loading websites are favored by both visitors and search engines. It's worth checking out their website and read about all the features of the theme. You can find many useful information here. I will leave a link to the Astra website in the description. With the free version of Astra, you can already achieve quite a lot. You can easily create beautiful and responsive websites that look great on any device. It comes with essential customization options such as adjusting typography, colors, and layout. However, if you want to unlock the full potential of the theme, it's worth considering the Astra Pro plugin. As you can see, the Pro version adds additional features like uh, custom headers, site layouts, WooCommerce support, uh, a complete site builder, and a lot more customization options. In the next part of this video, I'll show you how to easily install WordPress the Astra theme, and in the next video we will go through the most popular options of the theme, and we will also install the Astra Pro plugin and see what it can offer. So let's install WordPress first. I've already set up a subdomain for this uh, test website. I'm using the Plesk control panel. If you are using cPanel, you can also install WordPress from there, or you can install WordPress manually. So here in uh, Plesk, let's go to WordPress. Let's click install. I will select where I want to install WordPress. Let's just add the title. I will not use a plugin theme set. You can change the language of the website if you want. I will leave it on English and I will leave it on the current version. It's always a good idea to use the latest version of WordPress. Okay, if you want, you can change the username and the password, but I am not going to do that now. I will just click install. Okay, the WordPress has been installed. Let's check the website, let's refresh. And yes, we have the default WordPress installation. Let's go back to Plesk and let's log into the admin area. Okay, so we are now inside the WordPress administration. Let me just dismiss this. On a fresh installation, I always go to settings and set my permalinks. I will change this to post name. So this is how your uh, URLs will look like. 
click Save Changes. Okay, and now let's go to Appearance and Themes and let's install Astra. Click Add New Theme and um, Astra is here, but if you don't see it, you can just search for it. Click Install and then activate the theme. Okay, so now we can see that Astra is our active theme. And if we refresh the website, we will get the default Astra layout. Yes, everything is working fine. Now, it's always a good idea to install a child theme. A child theme basically inherits all the functionalities from the parent theme, in our case, the main Astra theme. But if you need to make any changes on a, on a code level and uh, you change the files of the main parent theme, they will be overwritten every time the theme is updated. And obviously this is not a good approach. So if you install a child theme, then you can add all your modifications, all your extra functionalities to the child theme and you don't have to worry about uh, when a new update is available for the parent theme. Astra provides a very easy way to create a child theme. You can go to wpastra.com slash child theme generator. So all we need to do is add a, a name for this child theme. I will call this Astra Child. Uh, click here to advanced options. We can set a version number. We can set the author name, uh, we can set an author URI, uh, we can change the description, and we can upload uh, a theme thumbnail. The image you upload here will be, will be basically uh, the image that is displayed uh, on this page for the theme. Okay, so I will just upload a file here and click generate, save the file, then go back to WordPress admin and here on the appearance themes, add new theme, select upload theme, select the file you just downloaded, click install now and activate. And now the active theme is our Astra child theme. And if we go back and check our website, nothing should be changed. So everything works fine. In the next video, we are going to go through the most important functionalities of Astra, and then we will install the Astra Pro plugin and take a look at those extra features as well. Thank you for watching, and if you have any questions, just please leave a comment below the video. Thanks for watching.